Hey guys, so um, I had I came across this thread and it was talking about what class would make the best waifu and of course I thought to myself, you know, this has to be done with Garbo and I think Garbo, you did the one actually, one of these not that long ago, didn't you? Uh, well, we, we were rating. Well, we were rating Monster Girls, but you know, let's get the <laughs> yeah, same thing. Well, I mean, you know, like that's what you get on Garbo's one for God's sake. <laughs> you know. uh, also, uh, Garbo's Kickstarter is doing amazingly well. It cracked fifteen thousand. Yeah, so, yeah, uh, that's kind of 15K. that's kind of insane. If I be honest with you, so I, I told James I took a screenshot and sent it to the Wizards of the Coast hiring email and told him to go fuck himself. <laughs> <laughs> Well, like that's that's like, what do you expect from Garbo? You know what I mean? Uh, again, that's, didn't you apply for a job with them a while back? I, I did, yeah. Like, like, well, we just don't think you're the right fit. I'm like, hmm, is that right, motherfucker? To, to be fair, though, I don't. Th I think they're actually right in that. I do think you're the, <laughs> not the right fit. First of all, you can actually light, which is not what they want, and <sighs> you're going to get into an argument with some SJW in the in the lunchroom. Let's be serious, you know, <laughs> in, in the lunchroom. Like yeah, so. yeah, it just. <laughs> wouldn't work out. I'm just going to be straight up. You can, you can imagine the passive aggressive emails that will be getting sent about Garbo constantly. Like, could you, you can make a sitcom about that. Honest to God, you can make a sitcom of Garbo working for Wizards, and I think it would actually be a pretty good show, not going to lie. But anyway, what is the best Garbo is part of the safe space, again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what is... So, Garbo, you go for it. You, you, I already said... I told him, I think, for me, I'm going to go top tier would be a paladin or a fighter. First of all, think of the action surge. You know what I mean? Think of the usefulness. Think of the action surge. <laughs> hey, I, oh, yeah, Garbo, you're the one that loves the bustle girls anyway, so come on. Look. Look. The, 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 the only correct answer here is not wizards because they'd be think of like like a like a wizard girl she'd like basically a neat she'd be kind of smelly close not wash she's like cheeto dust in her fucking braids uh, no, you could, I, I think i think you could work like the nerdy girl aspect you know what i mean i think you could work that but it depends i suppose you know the thing is wizards they kind of have to have the tism you know what i mean to a certain extent <laughs> Yeah, you know what, actually, you know what. Your autistic wizard girlfriend. <laughs> okay, you know what, autistic wizard girlfriend. Actually, you know what, that makes it at least an A <laughs> for Aspie girlfriend. An A? What? <laughs> okay, what are you going to go for? What C, put her in C. I'll, you know, I'll, like I'll, she... I'll meet you halfway and we're going to go B. How does that sound? I like, can, I'll meet you halfway. Like she, well, like, she might be a freak in the bed, you don't know that, but, like, like I learned this in the book once. Like, All right. <laughs> but, <laughs> For, for the most part, like, I am pretty sure they'd be just be fucking insufferable, like, babe, I was gonna say, no, I'm reading, for God's sakes, you're always reading, you know, like, that kind of shit. Uh, you know what, actually, you're kind of like, okay, you know what, I'll and give you, I'll give you, And you know, for a fact, for a fact, they do not pick up after themselves, uh-uh, wizards are gonna be, like, a sorcerer would be tidy, a wizard would be, like, this cluttered fucking, uh, no, you like, see what's neat cave. <laughs> you know what, you know what sorcerer would be, sorcerer would be prep girls, though. You know what I mean? I'm too good for you, type of. You know Prep what I mean? They're, they're, yeah, they're they're lech kids. You know what I mean? It's all I was the blood born this way. You have to yeah. work for it. Mm. You know, finally, <laughs> they, no sorcerer would be the worst. I'm go. I'm I'm just going to put that there. Sorcerer, you know, uh, she she would suck your dick, but she wouldn't enjoy it, and she wouldn't be into it at all. <laughs> she, she wouldn't the, enjoy. It. No, she wouldn't. She'd be like, you know what? I'm telling you, and she'd be sitting playing more on a phone or some mad shit. You know what I mean? No, you know, finally, like, sorcerer is solid D tier. Maybe, maybe possibly, maybe possibly. I see you can move them up for like socialite type. Like there would be e girls. There'll be a mix between e girls and like Donald <laughs> e -girls, Trump's kids. Yeah. You know what I mean? There would be like um, what do you call <laughs> Don her? Donald Trump's kids. Yeah, that's exactly what you would get. What do you call her? What's their name again? Um, uh, M Melinda or what her name is? Or oh, uh, I can't remember what her what her what her what his daughter's called now. But yeah, I, I don't think she'd be up for it, honestly. Um, yeah, absolutely. Ivanka? Ivanka, Ivanka that's no, a, no, that's a wife, isn't I, it? I, I, that's his wife. Yeah, I, yeah. I have no idea. I, um, I can't really um, care. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, same. Okay, you know what? Warlock, big titty golf girl again. She will make your life hell. And also, she's a teenage dream if you hate yourself. I don't Bro, know. It depends. You know for a fact, the warlock girlfriend will fucking will actually like treat you right. Like, she'd be like, because, like, in, well, of course, at the same time, with your warlock girlfriend, there's gonna be a patron always in the fucking wings oh, doing weird yeah. shit. Yeah. Cause like, you know, oh sorry, babe, I gotta go talk to my patron and you just know they're fucking. 
<laughs> so we got we, we come to think of it is the ultimate. I gotta year. level up, babe. I gotta go. <laughs> You're gonna go fuck that giant demon again, aren't you? Yeah. Well, it's not like that. I swear. You know what? So <laughs> if warlocks were our, uh, I think warlock would be the closest thing to a girl that doesn't only fans come to think of it. Actually, <laughs> it's kind. You know, think about it. Think about it. Uh, you know, look, you're sell you're kind of selling your soul to the devil, but in exchange you get great reward money wise, you know, so mm, yeah, on all sides. Silence type- winch. I don't uh, want to be horny anymore. <laughs> I just want to be happy. happy. <laughs> and what what type of girl would what type of girl do you want to go, go with a girl who would uh, make a pact with the devil? I don't know. I don't think that's a good way for you material, just to put that out there. I, I, I don't know. Which the, one's the worse? Part, the, the biggest part would be that there would be something else. And like basically, actually, if you think about it, in that relationship, you'd be the third wheel because it'd yeah. be her and her and her patron, and then you. Because when the patron calls, she has to answer. And, and imagine being like, you know what? It's probably fine. You go to date your warlock girlfriend. You, you, you like, oh, who's your patron? Oh, it's just it's like some huge ripped demon dude with a giant dick. Like, oh <laughs> fuck, god damn it! Yeah, you know what? Actually, uh, god I'm, damn I'm, it! I, 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 I think they're going to be even worse than sorcerers. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put. They're very tempting. You know, everyone wants the the big titty mm-hmm. golf girlfriend, but trust me, you don't want that unless you hate yourself and you got depression then you can have it but trust me 90 percent of people do not want the warrior girlfriend it's a trap now rogue on the other hand <laughs> think of the sleight of hand and I, you know what think of the sleight of hand well, well, and the dude. sleight of tongue you, that's an a uh, that's you an think S. girls are bad now about stealing your hoodies and shit but oh. the rogue will even find your fucking hoodies <laughs> yeah like your shoes are gone your hoodies are gone like what the fuck your underwear's gone you wake up you're fucking nude like what the fuck you know but, think but of i guess like fucking, you know possibilities you know what I mean? Let's be certain. No, to be fair, she would always get you, you into bother. Already come. <laughs> she would get you into a lot of bother. Anywhere you go, you couldn't like take. You couldn't go out anywhere with them. You know, they would always be getting you into issue. There would always be some from a problems <laughs> from stealing shit. Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, have you ever heard that uh, song by Luke Kelly, Black Velvet Band? If you lived in the eighteen hundreds, you would be getting shipped off to India. You know what I mean? That's all I'm gonna say. Um, <laughs> you know what? I th- she w- you would be. You know what? I'm gonna have to move them down. Actually, I'm gonna go with A. Well, the same thing is that you're not, you're not gonna find like big titty, big hipped uh, rogue girls because rogues gotta be alive. They gotta be yeah. kind of nimble. So, like, it, it, it'll, it'll obtain to if you want someone who's basically like, like a danger ballerina, then yeah, you go for a rogue girl. But same oh, time, oh yes, come on, know. think of it, think of it. Are you are you turning down a gymnast? You know what I mean? No, Jim. Yeah, come on. That's going at least A. The only reason why they're not getting an S <laughs> is because they would get into so much issue. It would just be a nightmare all the time. They're a solid A, if not S. But again, that depends on what they're like. You know what I mean? What mm-hmm. do you think? Now, go, uh, Ranger. I'm not an outdoorsy guy, you know? But you're I do basically look- dating a redneck. Like, yeah. <laughs> if you're like, if you like hunting, like, hey, babe, like, she's like, fuck, yeah, we go hunting. And if the what's kind of cool thing about ranger girls is that if you go out in the woods and you're hunting together, the whole like hour and a half thing may happen. You can fill the hour and a half in with all kinds of fun stuff out in the woods. But at the same time, if you're like, you know, a townsy, you're not going to like having a, a ranger girl because, like, hey, let's go out in the woods. I don't want to go in the woods because you're like, you know, I'm staying in my room with a computer and you guys are going <laughs> to fucking hate each other. Yeah, because I don't think it would work for me. I don't know. I'm not. I, I, you know, the thing is, I always end up having to go off camping and stuff. And I was in this thing where, when I was a kid, and we'd go off canoeing and all that type of stuff. And honestly, I just was not into it. Like, you know, I, I think most people would be like, well, what are you on about? It's like, I think it's because I had to do it as well, you know? That and also, I didn't really like the people I was sent off with. You know what I mean? It was kind of like a. <laughs> Yeah, it was I don't like, like it. Yeah, it just wasn't my thing. I don't know. I've always been a bit of a. I don't know. I've always been like that. So for me, I, Garb, it's up to you. You, you can place the ranger wherever you want. But Look, I know all it, it, just, it is, wouldn't be compatible. The, the, the ranger would be a very acquired taste. If you're a redneck like me, or an outdoorsman, or you like being out, out, out of your house doing stuff, the ranger would be S tier. However, not everyone is all about being outside, hunting, gathering, fishing, camping. They're not all about that. So for some, that'd be D tier, which I believe a nice, like, thick ranger girl is all about going out and hunting, can take care of herself, can clean a deer and skin it with, like, one hand behind her back. I think that's pretty A tier. All right, well, I'll I'll, I'll give you A, but I'm not going to put it above the Luke. How does that sound? 
fine. I, I would say it's pure. It's a it's a very taste matter, but I don't think <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a matter of taste. Really, <laughs> it is a matter of taste. Now, okay, Bard, let's go make this more interesting. Giga Slag, oh, you do, I, I don't think you want a Bard girlfriend, but but <laughs> you know it's very tempting. Also, think of think of like you know like like. What what happens when she gives you guidance? You know what I mean. What like you know she'd be very useful in day to day life. You know what I mean. Look, we we all know that a bar group has, has had more fucking tra- track time than a, than a fucking NASCAR. <laughs> all right, all the, right, okay. Then. She has more. She has more miles on her than like most fucking motorhomes. That that girl's be- was fucking beat out. <laughs> <laughs> all right, okay. But uh, is it worse than a warlock though? No. I, I, okay, I you know what? Better than a sorcerer or a warlock, because at least you would know some fun shit. At the same time, it's yeah. like you're going where lots of men have gone before. <laughs> All right. You know the thing is, it's like uh, again, like very tempting. I, I probably would if I had the chance, but definitely not waifu material. You know what I mean? Well, not really waifu. More like friend you know who's up who's up the game when the when, when, when the when the hour of the night calls so all right so great, uh, like, we'll, we'll put it above wizard then how's that sound that, that we'll, works yeah. top top of c but definitely not i i think honestly anything blue b and you don't want to be with you know what i mean would that be a fair assumption and the, like, yeah okay okay what do you want to do it furry like you know if you're furry <laughs> this is s if you're not Dude, a fur- furry <laughs> trash <gang. laughs> but also i think druid has the same qualities as a ranger essentially very similar well it'd be like having a group like who loves like gardens and plants yeah and, like, animals so it, so again that, that, that kind of sits in like the the country redneck aspect not really like a city folk aspect that's what's the problem with like rangers and druids is that they're actually the, quite the an, the uh antithesis of antithesis that's the right word antithesis? yeah i think so of uh, of like city living because because they, they want to be outdoors, want to go out and do stuff and be in the soil and be outside and fish and hunt and you know take care of animals or, or work with animal husbandry or farm. That's, that <laughs> requires every particular mindset to enjoy as a girlfriend slash wife. Yeah. And we were, and, but so it, it, if you ask me, Ranger and Drew be A tier or at least S tier. Uh, I'll, I'll, I know I'll, for some I'll, people that. that I'm te- like, see, I'm, I'm tempted to put it in with the ranger, just because for some people it would be as, but it suffers from the furry menace. Anyone, anyone <laughs> that puts anyone that puts good as S here is a furry. I don't care, and you've got problems. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Anyone that actually, uh, like, I, I'll, I'll give it to you a. If you're an outdoorsy person, I'll put it. Uh, yeah. uh, Druid and Ranger, I think, are tied. If you're an outdoorsy person, if you're not well, an outdoorsy person, that matters. What like what race the druid is because you, you, you get some big titty elf girl like ah I, you know. uh, yeah okay <laughs> you, you yeah that. yeah i suppose that's very true actually yeah yeah oh you know what we should have went you know what next time we'll do these how does that sound will we do leases <laughs> <laughs> okay we'll do that too we'll just do a, you, <laughs> a race tier <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's actually, you know what, that'll play this and do a lot of bother. Ultra fucking D tier run! This band. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay. Up next, what do you want to do? Do you want to do Barbarian? Megan fits the Barbarian archetype because she's forever <laughs> near getting the. Honestly, God, you guys have no idea. The amount of times I've almost gotten to. F- F- full on fights with people, like proper fist fights with like old Ben and stuff. It's ridiculous. I mean, like it's it, it's really bad. Like the Im- the amount of times that Megan's Amazon pressed me is insane. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even joking. It just it happens all the time. Like um, what was the most recent one? I already talked about that one, and then there was another time before that, and then oh my god, see see it like music festivals and stuff. Oh my god, it's M- Megan's ruthless at them. Like she's really bad. Um. You will, like, you're going to get into a fight with at least one person at a music festival with Megan. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, I think she's definitely fits the fits the mold, but um, she focuses her age at other people. Uh, not <coughs> all, so I'm happy with that. So Barbarians would keep life interesting. Yeah, sure. I'm, I'm going to go. Okay, and... you know what? I'm going to go for it, top of A. I think they've got a lot of good tweets about them. The only thing holding them back well, is if they're going to be a, are they psycho bitch material? Are they the type? That's well, just most barbarians are, are, are. See, most barbarians are, are, are going to be usually muscle girls in some in some variety. Whether it's a short stack muscle girl or a lanky muscle girl, going to be muscly in some way. Yeah, and they're going to require you to kind of do the same because they won't let you just be lazy around them. So they're going to be relatively high maintenance in terms of yourself. 
if you like going to the gym, if, if you like if you like going to the gym, I I like I like going to the gym. So like you know, yeah, I, but I, the best part about barbarian girlfriend is that on Valentine's Day or anniversary, you have this huge hulking woman, like trying to give you a Valentine's Day gift and like blushing and shit and stammering. Like, <laughs> I made you this. Like, oh, thanks, sweetie. It's nice. Oh, that's good. Cool. Like, like, cool. like, like that. That is like the perfect like. My life's an anime moment when your jack <laughs> when your when your giant muscle girl girlfriend goes, "I made you a Valentine's." Oh, honey, it's so nice. I hope you like. You're like crying. Like, like to me, that'd be hilarious to have and deal with. I think. But uh, yeah. again, where would you? I think it barbarian then? is a. Well, it's, it'd be an acquired taste because you know for a fact she's going on top like a lot. Harris <laughs> <laughs> getting to the heroin, like you know, here. If you, it, 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 it'd be a lot less sex and a lot more snoo snoo going on in the fucking household. So I would say. A, I would say actually like B tier, really. Would you go B tier? I would go B tier for A, Barbarian is B, but also for the amount of maintenance and cost that she would be, because A, you gotta feed her. And she's, <laughs> yeah, she's gonna go through a lot of steak. And she's sucking down steak and potatoes like every fucking day. Plus, you can't be fat and be with her, because she can expect you to have some kind of, you know, the same body type. So it'd be a lot more maintenance to well, enjoy your she, Barbarian yeah, girlfriend. Let's be serious. Barbarian girlfriend wouldn't go out with you, though, if you were not, uh, what would be their words, worthy? Would that be a word that a Barbarian uh, would use? Well, 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 unless your pipe game's fucking strong, or, like, <laughs> yeah. you're cute to them, or something like that. I mean, yeah. when, you, when you think about it, like, a Barbarian girlfriend may not want a Barbarian boyfriend, but may want just someone who's kind of different and normal ish you know yeah. like this guy let's animate that's fucking that's, that's okay all right i'll do it you know uh, well, as long that, as she, and, yeah. that and most men don't want a strong muscular girlfriend it, it may sound weird to some but most men want like you know like what was, was it the uh, soft tread wife meme or some shit uh, like, tread wife uh think of the children you know what i mean just put like there are aussie is Pardon yoked <laughs> Ozzy's yoked, so he is. He's absolutely massive. So, like, you know, <laughs> Ozzy's fucking yoked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, honestly, people won't believe me. You need to see his back muscles. Like, it's actually insane for a baby. Now, Mother, but... <laughs> I require more milk. <laughs> yeah, like, God well, damn, son. Well, the thing is, like, he's a year and a half, and he's well. Whenever he turned one, he was the average. He was the weight and height of a two-year-old. You know what I mean? And even whenever we take him to like soft play and stuff, the only thing that you can tell that he's younger is because he's got like baby hair. But he's <laughs> taller and heavier than I would say most three to four year olds. Honestly, that I think his only giveaway that he's younger is he's only babbling and he's got baby hair. But bar that, he's absolutely massive. So he is, you know. Is this your son like pinching some some other kid? Like your son's pinching my <laughs> kid. I know, isn't he great? Well, I was <clears> thinking, <throat> I'm thinking. I'm really tempted to like strap. Fifteen so minutes, dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really tempted to strap like some sandbags to him. You know what I mean? Like, uh, put some on his legs and on his arms and just let him, like, you know, do that, like, baby, like, totter about the house type of thing. You know what I mean? I've been thinking about that, but, like, maybe maybe when he's a bit older, you know what I mean? When he's a bit more sure at his feet. So, I don't know if you know this, but we've got a website with lots of models. And whenever I say lots of models, I mean lots of models. We've got models for any setting that you can think of. With humans with biddies, animals that shouldn't have biddies but do have biddies, dwarves and elves with biddies. Look, we've got a lot of smut models. But it doesn't stop there. We really do have models for anything and everything. And to be honest, they look so good. Chef's kiss, so good. But it's not all smart for all you good Christian Minecraft server players. We've got you covered. And we even got the weebs covered too, which is unusual for this channel because we don't <laughs> like weebs. <laughs> yeah, weebs aren't that bad. We, <laughs> also, just that bad. <laughs> we also have 5th edition subclasses and adventures, which some of them are free for download. And we sell physical printed copy of Steel Water as well. And you can request a signed version, if that's your thing, where I'll draw a penis on it for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, hey, if you want you know, us to sign a couple want, decks, that's we, what we, you we, want. We'll give you decks, okay, guys? That's, that's what anyway. We want. If you enjoy what we do here, go ahead and check out the website. It helps us out so so much, and we don't need to worry about our YouTube overlords striking down another one of our channels. Our website is also now available as an app on Android. Also, and the winner of the daily giveaway is this guy. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Look, anyway, uh, in for a chance to win, all you gotta do is like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, automatically entered in. And to claim the prize, you just send an email to neckbeardycontact at gmail.com. Let's go back to the video. But anyway, like, next up, 
Monk. Where would you put Monk? D. Get yeah. out of here. Shouldn't even be here. <laughs> I hate monks. Like I hate monks on principle. Yeah. You know, for a fascist, you should be a fucking insufferable twat. I'm well, so fast. Be... I'm so cool. Oh, she should be too into yoga, and I just can't go for that. <laughs> too into. Yeah. I just can't do yoga, bitches. Get, get <laughs> yeah, out of here. yeah. Uh, but, be... but we know for a fact she'd be like, she'd be always like one upping you, because like think of most rogue players and put it in a person, and it's literally all, all, all you gotta know. Yeah, constant, constant, constant a one up, a one, up one upsmanship, constant fucking picking fights. Like I can totally take that guy. Please don't. I gotta take him right now. Please do not take that guy. <laughs> Please, I beg you. You know, it'd be a constant fucking pain in the ass having her around. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, <clears throat> my biggest problem is I just don't really like monks as a class. So exactly. the idea of the white food <laughs> exactly. job, I'm just like, man, I'm still not into it. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just not. Go to it. D where you fucking belong, <laughs> monk. Uh, unless you like, 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 like behind warlock, like put it all at the rear. Uh, yeah, okay. You know what? Unless you're really, really into Asian girls, then. <laughs> Yeah, if you've got fucking yellow fever. <laughs> yeah, if, if I mean then yeah, I can give it to you. But like for, for us, no, I think I'm gonna put a D here, and that's mostly just because of the class. I do think going out with a warlock would be worse than going out with a monk, though. <laughs> Actually, you know, I'll, like warlock's still the worst for me. Right up next, Clark. I think Clark's a solid one. Okay, think the utility. So here's, All right, go for so it. here's here's the thing though. I've dated a lot of religious chicks. I. And I'm always shocked by the things they can do to me. <laughs> like, like there's one girl. She she's a Catholic, and I'm and after we we're done, I'm pretty sure that we were both going to hell after after that fucking night, dude. <laughs> like I was like, what? Work? Like you don't expect that shit from like I'm just a, <laughs> I'm just a good little Christian girl, and like the suck suck nine thousand come. Like, yeah. All right, your soul leaves your body. <laughs> ah! You know that kind of shit. So it depends on how much you into Catholic skull girl uniforms. Uh, well, if you're, if that, you're into that, like, then that's an S. <clears throat> I like think most I th clerics are usually wearing, you know, armor as well. So it's kind of mm. like the shy, holy girlfriend. Who, who, to me, the cleric is, is usually the kind of girl who wears like the robe and the armor, but underneath she has like shabari on or some shit. And you still <laughs> don't know it until you take her clothes off. Like, oh my god, it's full full of ropes. <laughs> like uh, they're so like the like like the the like the barbarian be openly kinky, rogue openly kinky, the cleric be like the sneaky kinky. Oh like, you, you, yeah. You, you, you never like see, see it that. coming until it's too late and suddenly you're coming, you know. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. I can see that. I S -tier. Mm, are you gonna go S tier, do you think so? S -tier. See yeah. I, that and when okay. she's done flogging okay. the shit out of you, she can actually heal you up. So don't worry <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I think she's got solid utility, extremely faithful, you know, she's got a lot of yeah, Oh yeah, on. yeah. You know Unlike I, the warlock who's banging her demon prince on the other side <laughs> yeah. of the fucking portal. Yeah, exactly. That's uh I, I think I think Kirk probably yeah, you know what, you're right. I I think <laughs> broke Kirk, my heart, Stacy. <laughs> Kirk does deserve an S tier. Now next up, I fighter. Fighter, I, mm. you had this whole action surge thing. I, there, right? I, I, yeah, but think of think think of the action surge. You know what I mean? That's all I'm putting that out there. You what, know what, what I mean? What do you mean by that? Like like, what, like one more pump or stroke? Like yeah, what do you mean action yeah, yeah. What, you know, like you know, going like going like mad. You know what I mean? Like you know, I think I'll I think I'll be pretty I think I'll be pretty handy just putting it out there. Think of the think of the class abilities that they have. But she'd be like the uh, tomboy bro girlfriend. We're like you two mesh really well. She's not like the other girls because she actually like wants to go and do stuff that's not just girly shit. She'd be like basically like the bro girlfriend. Well, and, that's what Megan the, would be like as well. Though I think I think you can mix barbarian in with that. I think. Uh, well, she she'll be nearly as high maintenance as, as a fucking barbarian girlfriend. No, she'd be I, like, well, no, think of it. A fighter has got far more discipline than a barbarian. You know. Well, I mean, I mean, it's like she, she, she won't be nearly as high, as high maintenance as in food and care and gym memberships. <laughs> she, she, she'd be able, she'd be a, a, a lot less maintenance in terms of being your girlfriend. Okay. And at the same time, it's like, but but she's still able to like chill on the couch or watch a movie. You know, not not like let's go for a ten mile run. <laughs> Barbarian plays. I'm tired, you know. She'd be able to chill. Like I, I think she actually actually, if you ask me. She might she, like a fighter girlfriend, maybe or a fighter waifu, maybe actually S tier, just for the pure fact of it'd be the, mo the the easiest one to get along with. No, you see, I th I think I think you're blending two of the best. I think you're blending Clark with fighter, and therefore you got Paladin, and therefore Paladin's the best. That's where I'm going to go for that. Uh, I mean, 
Hmm. I, th- I think you're blending I, the two together perfectly <coughs> in, in holy matrimony and you're creating the best waifu <laughs> by going for a paladin. Just put it out there. So w- I'll show you where I would put these. So I would put fighter. Fighter and Barbarian are pretty match and match. I would put them honestly on the same long. And then Paladin, I'm going to put it at the top of S. And the reason for that <laughs> being because I think you're mixing Clerk and Fighter together to make a Paladin. And therefore, like, all I'm saying is if if, if you're a Fighter or your girlfriend's a Fighter or you're a Clerk and your girlfriend's a Clerk, you're making a Paladin. All right? <laughs> you're, ma- the, you're making a Paladin. Yeah, you're making a Paladin. <laughs> that's, that's all I'm going to put out there. I think, I think Paladin's S tier. Um, I think I, honestly, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna just to fill this out a bit. I'm gonna so I'm gonna move Ranger and Druid down to B just because I think they're purely taste. You know, if you're an outdoorsy <laughs> person, they're perfect. Yeah, also good taste. If you, also, if you're furry, <laughs> then they're S. If you're <laughs> if, if you're going out with a Min Druid and you're not, put it like this, if you're going out with a Min Druid, I'm 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 highly sus of you. Just putting that out like there. You know, that that's what I think. I'm like, hold up here. What, what's going on? You know, <laughs> what's what's going on here? Why uh, is she? Why is she always in a cat form? Huh? Oh, Explain that. Come Explain that cat oh, you know what? Actually, the biggest thing, Warlock. Think of Warlock, mask of uh, thingy of many faces. She can look like whatever you want her to look like. Come on, that's amazing. But again, she you're still your a third wheel, dude. Yeah, you're, 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 you're still playing second fiddle to some asshole who's like fucking giving her powers. <laughs> yeah, like I guarantee y'all get in a fight. She go. Well, Shogoth gives me it gives me Shadow Bolt level three. Like you're like fuck. You're like what, what, what do you give her a fucking sandwich? Like you're, yeah. you're gonna be constantly playing catch up to the, some fucking shadow being who's like, I give her unfathomable power. You give her like a half ass like orgasm every once every two days. Like, Shut <laughs> yeah. up, dude. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. Like Warlock's going to be the bottom. Should be definitely the worst <laughs> of the waifus. Maybe uh, a, a good one off. Uh, Same with Bard. Honestly. Them two would kind of better as uh, as as fill in love taps really when you think about yeah. it. Yeah, like, like, like the bard and the thing the bard would be like hell yeah the bard is like the no strings attached friends with benefits. <laughs> yeah, <waifu>. um, wizard <laughs> is aspy girlfriend. If you're into ice aspy girlfriend, <laughs> then aspy girl. <laughs> yeah. If you want aspy girlfriend, then you go with wizard. That's an ass again. Look, this is all taste. Sorcerer. I don't know. I think sorcerer. I don't think they would be that into it. I think they would. They would know that they're better than you, and they would rub it on all the time. Definitely, um, old money type families. You know what I mean? I think. I honestly, no. I don't think I would want to go out with a sorcerer at all. I couldn't imagine anything worse. <laughs> I go. I think. I think honestly, sorcerer would be definitely up there. Monk. I'm not into yoga. And I just don't like the class. <laughs> really, that's really what it comes down to for me. Honestly, I just don't care much for monks at all. Um, well, it's just you know for a fact they'd be an absolute nuisance. Like <laughs> they would, and they would talk, try to talk to you. Like, you know what they would be? You know what monk would be? They would be like gemstone girlfriends, like crystals and all that type of shit. <laughs> that's exactly what, yeah. The they, fucking chakras. <laughs> yeah, they would be going on about dream catchers and all that type of shit to you. You know what I mean? Ooh, you know, uh, a non, your chakras really like hostile right now. Like, would you? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> please, please. Um, <clears throat> Why am I dating you? <laughs> so I, I, I think, like, you know, there's uh, pretty much all of them have their own benefits. Just and not you. all DD waifus are, are created equal here. I'll yeah. say that much for sure. I like, mean, they're just my biggest hang up is probably actually the warlock waifu because you're, like I said, you're playing second fiddle every day to some cosmic being who's like giving her boons and shit. And, and, we, and what do you do? Get her McDonald's? Yeah. <laughs> how do you how do you keep up with that <laughs> shit? It's impossible. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna beat that. Oh, what about Clark though as well? With Clark, what do you mean? that would that matter though? Because again, you. I, I don't think so. I mean, yeah. it's one of those things where you know. It also depends on who she's because there are clerics of the Raven Queen, clerics of every god there is. It all depends yeah. on what kind of cleric it is. But even this, like, you know, they're not they're, they're not going to be nearly as weird as a warlock or a monk or a sorcerer. But, they're going to be a, 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 a little more traditional. But you know? would a cleric count as like a nun essentially? Would it fit? Into- I, I, don't, I don't think so. I mean, yeah. there's, been, there's, there's, there's been arguments for that. I, I know that much, but I wouldn't really call them a nun per yeah. se. Yeah, if they if they go into nun tier. <clears throat> or if they go into more of a nun category, then I would definitely knock them down quite a bit. So I would. To be fair, though, there are a lot of hot nuns out there. All right, like. <laughs> well, but uh, well, I don't know. But the, the cleric is not usually the nun archetype. Usually, they're kind of a battle. Yeah, monk. I would. I would say so. That's what I would. Uh, and then a paladin again is just more of a. 
combat oriented oriented cleric. You yeah, know? that's why she 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 would be like a muscly cleric with oh, like abs and shit. And also to finish it off, to finish it off, the reason why Paladin asked here, instead of lay on hands, lay on blue jobs. Just panatic there, guys. All right, <laughs> just 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 lay, panatic there. Lay, what, 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 lay on lips. With <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, okay, okay. You know, if you want, you can always summon. You can always be a world. You could always go out with a warlock. You can always summon a succubus to suck through your soul out of your deck, or or you get lay on blue jobs and just be happy with that. You know what I mean? Which let's I mean, be serious. At, 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 at that point, if you're going to try to hire a succubus, why have a fucking goth girlfriend anyways? Just yeah. get a fucking succubus. Yeah, I suppose that's there, there, true. There's no winning with, like, saying, there's no winning with warlock girlfriend. There just is no winning. You're just fucked, no matter what the hell you do. Yeah. One way or another. Yeah, you Because either you're because because either you're playing second fiddle to some cosmic being, or you're having a, or having like someone a succubus to get like actual affection mm. that you know is at least somewhat two directions. You know, yeah. <laughs> it's just no fucking winning. So, what do you say? Are you are you happy with this tier list? Where where would you move to, uh, Garp? Where where do you think? Where would well, you? Well, actually, I'm starting to think that maybe Bard should be B tier for the fact that you have like a friends with benefits that has no qualms with just like doing a quick bang out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, like there is. If there's there, one there class, there's a, a chance of your deck falling off though. That's the only thing. Do what? You, there's a high chance of your deck falling off with the Bard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe, but still, like, okay. It's a bard, not bad. You, you, you could never, you could never, like, she's definitely, you, you, you're never gonna have a good ship with a bard. You know what I mean? You're never gonna be able to go out with well, them. Well, that's why, I, well, I think they're B tier. All right, I mean, I'll, I'll move them to bottom of B. How does that sound? That's fine. Because there's something to having like, a, like you're really lonely, but like, say, say you're a guy who like, I just want flesh slaps and no strings attached that's where the bar comes in like hey you know what i mean yeah i could see that i could see that there there there, there, there is a, a a a a pro and con to the yeah. bar yeah yeah uh also yeah i think luke would be pretty good i don't know i think i'm almost tempted to no actually no luke's perfect where it is now i think like i think that's where we're gonna wrap up where would you guys where how would you guys organize this tournament? <laughs> when the rogue steals, steals your virginity, like fuck, man, <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, where would you guys go? Are you, do you think guys think we're completely off? Do you guys think? Oh my god, Garbro and James are so unbased right now. <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't do it. Like is clearly the best. <laughs> uh, yeah, Warlock is great if you hate yourself. Just put a, if you want to go out, the life comparison is literally a girl on OnlyFans. You know, do you do you want to go out with a girl on OnlyFans? That's that's a Warlock. You know, that's that's what you get. I think that's the best way to describe you get, it. Anyway. You get what you fucking deserve. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, you know what? I'll put I'll put Monk in C. Monk bottom of C. Uh, she's going to be into Dreamcatchers and all these shitty New Age religions. <laughs> crystal here, here on crystals. And these fucking Dreamcatchers. Like yeah. You know. <laughs> But, you know, again, I think that's more of a matter. Again, the yoga. Oh my god, the yoga constantly. I can hear James. God, I fucking hate Dreamcatchers. <laughs> <laughs> he walks by like a, a head shop. He's like, oh my god. <laughs> I'm thinking of the mouth. Yeah. So, where would you guys put it? What do you guys think? Uh, also, before I forget, Garbgoo's Kickstarter. Um, if you don't know anything about it, check out the video that we did together or the live stream. Uh, Garbgoo yep. has also does live streams of Let's Plays. Uh, what days do you do them? Uh, Saturdays. Saturdays on Twitch. So there you go. Uh, anything yep. else we should bring up? Oh, oh, by the way, guys, um, Royal Mail was back on. I've, I sent out a ton of stuff today, so I did. Who? Royal Mail. Um, you know the way Russians threatened to put anthrax in the post? And like, well, they weren't. Uh, well, they are Russians. It was a Russian hacker group. They, uh, it was in security breach and they stole all the information from Royal Mail and they said that they were going to put anthrax in the post and that's why hacking or pushing <laughs> yeah and they said um, they won 50 million and uh, I don't know but they managed to get it through now hopefully Royal Mail will just paid up so, she, so they did just cause I need to get stuff sent internationally so if you've bought um, st- if you bought our Kickstarter it should be coming out to you very soon um, it's going to take a few days, and also if you bought models, it's also only going in, in the post now, so hopefully you guys will get all that soon. But, uh, yeah, we love you, Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> and we'll see you next time, alright? <laughs> Bye-bye. Yeah.